right. The next one is from uh, – uh, the next one is from uh, Matthew Hardy. He's been a regular in the mailbag this week. It's not I, maybe it is Matt Hardy. You think it's Matt? Maybe, yeah, I think it is. All right. Uh, subject is Olympic. We're gold odd medal- to you, Matt. Olympic gold medalist Gable Stevenson contemplates future in WWE. Hi, Disco and Conan. Your show has been seriously kicking. It's been awesome listening, learning, and having a laugh. Sports Illustrated came out with the article on Gable Stevenson, who said after winning gold, is heading over to Vegas to watch SummerSlam. Stevenson came out and said. If I ever go to WWE, I'd be a Paul Heyman guy. Heyman is a legend. We'd be two people doing great things. That'd be a tough team to beat. And I've known Brock since I was in high school. He'd been there for me for a long time, making sure I do things the right way and put my best foot forward. If Gabe makes a decision to move into WWE, can you see him having success similar to Kurt Angle, or do you feel the transition Kurt Angle had was something far too rare to expect to happen again from an Olympic freestyle gold medalist? Thanks for your insight and answer my question, Matthew. Number one, Matthew, you can't. I don't even know if this guy can work. Like being a legitimate wrestler, like Kurt Angle picked pick wrestling up very yeah, quickly, or like a prodigy. Yeah. So like I don't, I don't. This you can't. I have no idea about this. And bro, they've they've hired tons of amateur wrestlers and stuff. They're in their they're in their farm system right now. So I don't, just because this guy's had success yeah. in real wrestling doesn't mean he's going to be better better than the, than professional wrestling. So. They they could bring him in like Angle. Like oh, it's another. He's an Olympic gold. Bro, we don't even know if he all. can work. No, that's true. But if he's a fan. Yeah. He might he might already know a little bit. He oh, you, might get you can't, it. You can't you can't book a guy if you don't know how to work. Yeah. Well, obviously, you have to go through development. I work. I agree with what Disco says, but also the fact that he's a fan helps because he knows what he's getting into. You know, he, he isn't completely lost, and he obviously watches because he's referencing Paul Heyman, and that's pretty cool. Because when I was growing up, I never heard anybody going, "I want to go to WWE," and you hear that a lot now from athletes you know that they want to get into wrestling they respect it where before it's kind of kind of laughed at and also uh those are the type of people you want that pedigree and i'll tell you why because we're doing a we're going to start a training center which is going to be a lot of money they put a good investment into this in mexico and they were asking me what type of people i recruit and where would i get them and all that and one of the main things i told them was like former athletes from mma from the fitness world gymnasts wrestlers you know like that because they already have that work pedigree in them you know uh but this guy's a gold medal winner which is the top of the food chain athletically we don't know if he's worth a damn in the ring but if he is and he has a personality and he can talk you got a winner yes sir 